Hey everybody, I'm Jahangir Rirani for Mashable.com. How cool would it be if you could control a hovercraft with just your iPod? Well now, you can. Today, we'll be testing a remote-controlled hovercraft called the AR Drone. It's made by Parrot, a French company best known for its wireless devices for mobile phones. The drone and handset communicate by way of a secure Wi-Fi link. In just three easy steps, they're connected. The accelerometer inside the iPod allows it to control all three axes of flight. Up, down, and around. To fly it, I just put my thumb on the left button and tilt the phone in the direction I want it to move. If I want to climb, descend, or rotate, I just put my thumb on the right button and move it up, down, or around. The AR drone comes with two onboard cameras, one looking out the nose and the other pointing straight down. You can view either camera directly on your handset and you can switch between the two views by pressing the toggle button. Its optimal flying height is about 20 feet, although technically you can go about 160 feet high based on the reception you'll get with your Wi-Fi signal. Anything higher and you might need a pilot's license. The only downside is that each battery lasts approximately 12 to 15 minutes. So if you want some quality flying time, make sure you pick up an extra battery or two. You'll also want the extra batteries because this toy is just as much fun for the adults as it is for the kids. Parrot is planning to make the AR drone compatible with Android devices in the near future. Until then, fly safe. For Mashable.com, I'm Jahangir Rirani.